I still have to vote for PDP. We will vote for Abraman Abrasak. He preferred the Goronshi candidate of APC. With different people comes different views and different ideas. I am Tommy Sinola and this is Street Voices on This Is Far, where we sample the opinion of people on the street concerning different issues in our society. It is the government of the people, for the people, by the people. And as elections draw nearer, some people are stuck in a pool of choices while others have made up their minds. With Razak Atuma for PDP, Abdurrahman Abdurrazak for APC, Isa Remu for Labour Party, Ade Doing Ayorinde for a court party amongst about 30 other gubernatorial candidates who truly deserves to be governor of Kwara State 2019? Who do Kwarans want? Join me as I take a peep into the minds of Kwarans to answer these questions. Who do you think deserves to be the next governor of Kwara State? Uh, from my own point of view, I will um, prefer the, uh, the APC candidate. But for all along, for the past 16 years, we've been having uh, you know, same PDP, whatever defection, one way or the other. So let's see. Uh, Let's have a change and see what uh, we do within the state and the local government uh, and the area. So we vote for Abraman Abrasak. Why? Uh, the reason is that uh, the uh, present administration in the state is still one-sided. So we need a change of hand. That's just the simple reason. Okay. We want to try another person. You are still have to vote for PDP. Okay, why? Um, they have a structure. They have something they are working on. And the opposition party, I don't understand their motive. Because if you are an, an opposition, you have to tell us why we have to fold these people out. They don't have a plan. They don't know what we are, they are doing. And there's a lot of violence going on from their side. So we really need to know what they want from for choir state because we seem not to understand them. And um, with the PDP, with the new um, manifesto, um, Honorable Atsu has granted, I believe, yeah, we should be able to do something better. We should have a better government in the next four years, hopefully. With the state of things and the desire of the people, APC candidates must definitely win all the election because all the atrocity, goodness and kindness of uh, past uh, leaderships have been known to the people. So I believe uh, it's a glaring issue that is uh, APC candidate that will definitely take, win the election. Why? Ah, Abdul Razak Abdurrahman. I prefer him to be the next governor of this state. Why? Uh, if you look at it, um, since the creation of this state, since 1967, when you compare this state to other states of the federation, there has not been major developments in this state. It's like he's only one man ruling this state. So is when you present a candidate, that candidate must be the governor, that candidate must be the senator. But now we want to have a new team in this state. So let's try another man and let's see where Kwara will move to in the next four years. So I prefer Abdurama Abdurazak. Is it just because the other party has been in power for 16 years or you personally like the candidates? No, not just because of that. Um, in terms of infrastructural development and um, I mean uh, human uh, management, employment, civil service stuff, what they take home and um, I mean, uh, the, the life in general, it, there is, you know, the atmosphere is not too conducive here. And uh, with the subvention from federal government, the state, quite quite high arrest, we expected that uh, you know, it would be more judiciously used. So but we, what we are seeing, uh, there is need for, I mean, a change. Actually, let's see what the, 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 
the APC candidate will do for the next uh, four years. With the election just about 45 days away, tension is rising and the people are getting more determined to stand by their choices. It's all about to go down. You have heard the opinions of Quarant. This is Street Voices and this is Quara.